How are you, friends? My name's Miss Monica. What's your name? Oh, well, I'm so happy you decided to come to circle time today. Oh, did you hear that? Listen. Listen. Put on your listening ears. I think I hear our good morning train coming. The good morning train is coming. How are you? Choo choo. The good morning train is coming. How are you? Choo choo. The good morning train is coming. The good morning train is coming. The good morning train is coming. How are you? Choo choo. And we'll say hello to our friends wearing purple. Choo choo. Hello, friends. And we'll say hello to our friends wearing blue. Choo choo. Hello, friends. And we'll say hello to our friends, all of our friends wearing pink. Choo choo, hello friends. And we'll say hello to our friends wearing orange. Choo choo, hello friends. And we'll say hello to our friends wearing green. Choo choo, hello friends. And we'll say hello to our friends wearing yellow. Choo choo, hello friends. And we'll say hello to our friends, all of our friends wearing Black, choo choo, hello friends, and we'll say hello to our friends wearing white, choo choo, hello friends, and we'll say hello to our friends wearing brown, choo choo, hello friends, and we'll say hello to our friends wearing red, choo choo, hello friends, and we'll say hello to our friends, all of our friends, and we'll say hello to everyone that's come to circle. Choo, choo. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to Circle Time. Thank you, good morning, train. Oh, my friends, we have so much to do today. It's the beginning of the week, and I'm so excited to be here. How are you feeling today? Oh, oh, really? Well, thank you for sharing how you feel today. Let's get started on our very busy morning. Let's head over to our Circle Time board. Come on, let's go together. Now. We need to get started on reviewing our entire circle time board. And because it's the beginning of the week, we get to find out the new letter of the week, the new shape of the week. Oh, and so much more. And who's going to help us with the weather this week? Oh, let's get started, friends. But first, I need to find my... My pointer. But guess what? I have another pointer. Now I have two pointers. There are so many different kinds of pointers that I can use and that you can use at home too. So this week, I'm going to try using this pointer and we'll save this one for next week. But let's try a new pointer this week. This will be our pointer for circle time. Are you ready? Oh, wonderful. Let's start with our days of the week. Get ready, get ready. Here we go. There's Sunday and there's Monday. This Tuesday and this Wednesday, this Thursday and this Friday, and then this Saturday. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. One more time. This Sunday and this Monday, this Tuesday and this Wednesday, this Thursday and this Friday, and then this Saturday. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. Days of the week, days of the week. We did it. And now my friends, let's find out what day it is today. We need to go back over to the board. So follow our new pointer. Do, 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 do. Yesterday was Sunday. Can you say Sunday? Great, yesterday was Sunday. Now let's go down one. Do, 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 do. Today is mm, Monday. Monday, today is Monday, today is Monday, today is Monday, all day long. Yes, today is Monday, today is Monday, today is Monday, all day long. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes, my friends, today is Monday, M for Monday. Can you say Monday? Great, now let's put Monday on the board. We'll put it up here. Great, great, great. Now, my friends, let's read the sentence together. Today is Monday. Let's read it together one more time. Today is Monday. 
It sure is. Today is Monday and it's the beginning of the week. Now, let's go down to the next thing. What's next on our board? What's the weather? What's the weather? What's the weather out today? Is it sunny? Is it cloudy? Is it raining out today? What's the weather where you live? You may have to go look out your window and then come back and tell me what you see. I'll give you some time. Oh, my friends, what did you see? What's the weather where you live? Oh, ooh, really? Well, thank you for sharing what the weather is where you live. Now let's find out what the weather is here, where the Circle Time classroom is. Oh, my friends, let's head over to our imaginary window. Let's go over to the imaginary window and find out what the weather is. Let's go together, come on. Oh, here we are. We made it to our imaginary window. It's right here. Now, look out the window. What do you see? <gasps> What's the weather here where the Circle Time classroom is? What's the weather? Oh, my friends, it looks like it's raining out today. It's raining. It's pouring. It's raining today. That's right. So now we need to find a picture that represents a rainy day. Will you help me find that picture? Great. Let's go back over to our circle time board and find that picture. Let's go together. Oh, we're here. Now, let's look for a rainy day picture. I have a few pictures here. Let's see if I have a rainy day picture. My friends, is this a rainy day picture? Yes or no? Aww. No, if you said no, you're correct. This is not a rainy day picture. This is a sunny day picture. Let's keep trying. Ooh, my friends, is this a rainy day picture? Aww. No, if you said no, you're correct. This is a snowy day picture. Let's keep trying, my friends. Oh, is this a rainy day picture? Yay! Oh, yes, yes. If you said yes, you're correct. This is our rainy day picture. So let's put our rainy day picture up on the board right here. Now let's read this sentence together. It says, the weather is rainy. Yeah, it's a rainy day. Let's read it together one more time. The weather is rainy. It sure is. It's a rainy day here where the classroom is. Now, who are we going to help today get ready for this rainy day? Last week, Bear Bear was here. This week, who is going to come for the weather? Oh, let's see. Our special weather guest is... Dun, 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 dun. Get excited, get excited. Piggy! Hello, Piggy! Piggy is here. Piggy Pig! Piggy Pig is here to be our special weather guest this week. So Piggy Pig is going to help us this week. Oh, Piggy, we're so happy you're here. Okay, let's put Piggy on the board. Uh, we'll put Piggy right over here. Okay, Piggy, how about out there? Oh, I think we're ready. We're ready to help Piggy get ready for the day. Now, are you ready to help? Great, so our friends at home are going to help. I'm going to help. We're all going to help together. So since it's a rainy day, hmm, I wonder, do you think Piggy should wear her rain boots? These are her rain boots. Or should she wear the red sneakers? What do you think she should wear on this rainy day? You can point or you can say aloud. Oh, if you said rain boots, I agree. Since it's raining out, let's get Piggy some rain boots and save the sneakers for another day. Okay, Piggy, rain boots it is. Oh, and her rain boots are pink and she's pink. Well, I think Piggy Pig must like some pink. All right, let's keep going. Now, do you think Piggy should wear, hmm, a purple shirt or her raincoat? What do you think? She has a raincoat with a little hood or her t-shirt. Which one? You can point or you can say aloud. Oh, if you said raincoat, I agree. It's raining out. She should wear her long raincoat. Let's save the t-shirt for another day. 
Okay, we'll put the raincoat on. Oh, here you are, piggy pig. There you go, raincoat on. And let's keep going, my friends. We have to still help her. Oh, what do you think piggy pig wants to wear? Now her raincoat is pretty long, but should she wear some green pants or maybe her red skirt? What do you think? She has her boots on still. Oh, you can point or you can say aloud. Ooh, why don't we try the red skirt? She can wear her red skirt as long as she has her boots on in the rain. You want to save the green pants for another day? Okay, good idea. Let's try it. Okay, piggy pig, we'll put on your red skirt. Oh, I think she's ready. Oh, do you think she should hold anything in the rain? Something that may cover her entire body. What can she hold in the rain that will cover her body and help her to not get wet? How about it? An umbrella. Yes, if you said umbrella, I agree. And you're correct. She can hold an umbrella. Okay, let's give her her umbrella. Oh, Piggy, I think you're ready. How about there? We'll keep the umbrella right here. Hold on. Okay, Piggy is ready. She's ready for the rainy day. Have a good day, Piggy. Oh, my friends, thank you for helping. You're such great helpers. Now, let's keep on going. Let's go down, oh, to our letter of the week. Oh, our letter of the week. Last week, the letter was, hmm, K. So what comes after letter K in the alphabet? How about this? Let's say the alphabet all the way up to letter K, and then let's try to figure out what comes next. Are you ready? Okay. Let's sing it together. Get ready. <laughs> Get ready. Here we go. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. Oh, if you said L, you're correct. H, I, J, K, L, L, M, N, O, P. Let's go. Q, R, S, let's finish. T, U, V, W, X, Y, N, Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Oh, but you already sang with me. Thank you, and I hope you'll sing with me again. So after letter K is letter L. L is our letter of the week. L. This is uppercase L and lowercase L. Can you say L? That's right, L. And every letter makes a sound. And L says, ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, it's a funny sound. You roll your tongue up to the top of your mouth and go, ooh. That's letter L. L for lion. That's right. L for lion. Oh, look at this. I have a picture of a, a lion. Lion. That's right. L for lollipop. L for lemon. Ooh. L is the letter of the week. Let's put L on the board. Here you are, L. L is our letter of the week. Okay, now let's keep going. We did our days of the week. We did our weather. We did letter of the week. What's the shape of the week? Last week we talked about the circle. This week we're going to talk about this shape. Oh, it has four sides. Dun, 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 dun. Who knows what that is? It's a rectangle. Can you say rectangle? Great. Rectangle is our shape of the week. The rectangle has two long sides and the rectangle has two short sides. That's right. And there are Four sides all together. Four. Let's count them. I'll hold it. I'm going to count with my pointer finger. One, two, three, four. Four sides the rectangle has. And there are so many things that look like a rectangle. This card I'm holding actually looks like a rectangle. It has one, two, three, four sides. It has two long sides and two short sides. This is a rectangle. What other things can you think about? that look like a rectangle. How about a book? Some books are shaped like a rectangle. 
I want you to start looking around your home and looking outside too. If you're, when you're outside, look to see if you can find things that are shaped like a rectangle. And we'll keep on talking about the rectangle and all the different things shaped like a rectangle all week long. Okay, my friends, let's keep on going. Now it's time for us to count. And this week, we're still counting from numbers one all the way through 10. Let's keep on practicing. Okay, let's count together. Let's do it slow first. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One more time at that pace. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great counting. Let's go a little bit faster and a little louder too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Again, one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You all are doing wonderful, great counting. Oh, you are going to be experts at this counting. Thank you for helping me. And thank you for helping me complete the entire Circle Time board today. Now, my friends, it's time for us to sing our Circle Time song. So let's head over to our desk. Come on, let's go together. Okay, we're here. Today's Circle Time song, I figured, why don't we do the alphabet song? Now, we sang it earlier, but let's sing it one more time together. And I think I may even add some bells. Yes. Now, if you have any instruments at home, you can use your instruments when we're singing all of our Circle Time songs or any of our Circle Time songs. If you don't have instruments, it's okay. You can always clap your hands. You can tap. Whatever you choose. So let's start with the alphabet song. We'll sing it two times together. Okay? Are you ready? All right, my friends, let me get the song ready. Oh, here we go. Can't wait. Here we go. You ready, my friends? We're gonna sing it together, nice and loud. You can do it. Here we go. A B C D E F G H I J K. Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. Now I know my ABC. Next time, won't you sing with me? Great. Again. Here we go. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R Let's do it one more time. One last time. We can do it. If you have your instruments, you can shake them, make noise with them, clap your hands if you want. Here we go. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, C, U, V, W, X, Y, N. singing my friends great singing thank you for singing the alphabet song with me i had so, such a wonderful time reviewing the entire circle time board with all of you oh it's time for us to say goodbye but my friends i will see you again tomorrow bye friends <laughs>